First Lady Dr. Jill Biden sat down with veterans, military spouses, and leaders and organizers from the Stephen A. Cohen Military Family Clinic during her second day in San Diego County. She discussed mental health resources for those that have served our country and their families. Mental health, I think, is so important in our military. And uh, I think, really, you know, people tend to forget a lot of people in the United States don't know anybody in the military. And we, you know, we're more aware of the military when, uh, when we're in uh, times of war. But now we're in times of peace. Veterans who have been to this Oceanside Clinic for help shared their experience with Dr. Jill Biden. I knew that if I didn't get help, um, I would end up killing myself. And, um, and that's just the that's just me being real like that's that's where I was at because sometimes you can't do it yourself and I realized that like I wasn't able to do it myself um, but that was okay because I got the help that I needed. Those with the clinic say it's invaluable to have the first lady listen to their efforts firsthand and they were able to share the resources they need to help more veterans and military family members with their mental health worldwide. I believe this roundtable discussion went very well. I, we are all thrilled to have uh, Dr. Joe Biden here today um, and just share about our clinics but also share about how we can help and how we are working to provide strategies and solutions to mental health care um, and helping to break the stigma that often goes along with the words of mental health care. Dr. Jill Biden's Joining Forces initiative has been a focus during her two-day visit in the San Diego region, which supports military, veteran families, and caregivers. You're doing service not just in military service. You're doing service to your community, and that's what really counts. This was the First Lady's last stop in the San Diego region, and now she's heading just a little bit up north where she's expected to be a presenter at the 65th Annual Grammys on Sunday night.